It seems like all the kingdoms in this world have something of value that they trade with others. Since my kingdom fell, I think it's time to start a new business. Welcome to Dreamy Designs. Well, it's not actually here yet, but um, this is a spot for a future tailoring shop. Here I can sell wool, leather, string, and my custom creations. You see the outfit that I'm wearing? I made that myself. So if anyone needs any supplies or custom work, they can come to me. As long as people need what I'm offering, this will be good. As you can see, Glimmer Grove is in desperate need for some materials. Let's head back home for now to see if we have any materials to get started. While I was checking my inventory and preparing for my business, a local mangrove dwelling frog witch came to my door. She requested a custom hat, which I agreed to make, but my shop wasn't ready yet. I sent her away with the promise of free delivery once the tailoring shop was built and I had a place to work. Wow, we have our first customer before our shop is even open. I better get this project started. I have made the realization though that I can't have a shop without having any inventory to sell. So before we actually make dreamy designs, I need to set up some farms to keep my business booming. Since I'm selling wool, string, and leather, I'll need to make a sheep shearing area, a spider madurdering area, and a place for the cows to meet their end. First we do what's easy. We need to uh make a hole for the Cow Crusher 5000. <laughs> that sounds mean, but that's what it is. If we dig a hole like this, add a chest, some hoppers, and then surround it by wood with some stairs on top, then our leather farm is basically done. We just need to add some water on the bottom. I know it doesn't look like much, but this is it. Let's bring over the cows. All right, we'll do one at a time. Hello, sir. Would you like to fall in this hole? Yes. Into the hole. Yes! Okay, now, just need to add a fence. Oh, oh no. Did I mess this up? They're bouncing very high. I may have messed this up. There we go! They were just bouncing a lot. If you breed them enough times, they will do the deaths and the remains will pop out here. <laughs> Make baby. Woo! Now that the cows are all set up, Next, we need to harvest some fluffy sheep wool. I eventually want to offer all colors of wool, so I want to build the sheep square. Luckily, I have loads of spruce wood for this, but I'm gonna need to make glass, hoppers, rails, levers, and a bunch of other things before we start. Okay, dispensers, observers, powered rails, chests, barrels, fences, stairs, trapdoors, redstone, planks, slabs, levers, glass, hoppers, shears, and hopper minecarts. That should be everything I need, so let's go build a sheep square. Are. Well, they'll be a lot cuter once they're decorated and have roofs on them. But before we can do that, we gotta fill them up with sheeps. Hello, would you like to be part of my business? To get into the hole. Could you? In the hole. Stop. Go. No, in the hole. Go. It's too fluffy. It doesn't fit. Let's try this. I can lead you into the hole. <gasps> That works. Oh, but now my lead is stuck in there. This is a problem. Hold on. Wait. Is it in here? <gasps> yes! I got my lead back. Now I must suffer and try to get sheep in all the other places. farm is complete. And so is the spider farm. The spiders are kind of gross, so I didn't think you'd want to see me build that one. I could show it to you, though. Look, look, look. So over here, oh! <laughs> in this hole, we have a ladder that leads to the spooters. Disgusting. But yeah, now that all these farms are working, I think it's time to build my tailor shop and make the surrounding area look a little nicer. We're gonna need more materials. Remember how last time I said something like, why would I ever need to go to the end? Well, turns out if I wanna build with pretty purple blocks, that's exactly where I need to go. I'm only going for plants and end stone, so it should be a quick trip. I should take precautions though. Ta-da. 
As I was on my way to the end, a being from the birch forest appeared. Hello there, Catherine. Hello, Lizzie. She came for colored wool and offered shiny crystals in return. We made a trade and she scurried off into the distance. For a second, I thought I saw some paw prints. Interesting. Well, I'm off to the end. I have arrived. Look at all the plants. I shall take them all. enough now. I got a stack of end stone, 10 chorus flowers, and a bunch of fruit. Let's get out of here. Once I got home from the end, I went straight to the mines where I gathered some diorite and stone. After that, I went to the surface in search of sand and gravel to make concrete, and then I made a small farm back by my house for more chorus fruit. I grabbed some white wool from my new sheep area, and then I headed to the nearby flower forest so I could make some blue dye. Okay, I've made a temporary setup over here to prepare for my building, but while I wait for my blocks to smelt, I do need one more thing. The last thing my future shop needs is terracotta. And the only terracotta around these parts of the world is south in the Mesa. Whoa, look at all that terracotta. I heard that there was a sheriff in charge of this area, but I don't see him anywhere. Do you think he would mind if I took some of this? I definitely don't want to get in trouble with the sheriff. Maybe I could leave a sign somewhere. Let's see, where is he living? Oh, hey, maybe he's living there. Let's just go all the way down here and we could leave a sign there the sign says took some terracotta please don't arrest <laughs> hopefully he won't be mad what is this people who respect the law and the sheriff whip sausage and gem what hold hold, hold on i respect it <clears throat> catherine <laughs> see is that, is that how that works? I hope that's how that works. Well, anyway, I'm gonna leave the blocks by his base alone and uh, I'll grab some terracotta away from here. This mace is pretty big. He probably won't even know I took anything. Finally, I think we have everything we need to start building. build in Glimmer Grove. Before I show you my shop, let me show you what else I did. So first, as you can see, I made a path to connect everything together. And then over here, uh, I made this cute little building to cover up the cow farm. Oh, hello. Um, we have some unexpected guests that I do not want on my tour. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. Okay, hold on. I'll be back on the tour in a moment. What? Hello? Interesting. I went to my house to go get some fire, and now they're gone. Maybe they remembered what happened the last time I brought fire to a fight. Well, anyway, back to the tour. Back here, I built a tall tree in the middle of the sheep square, and I added a lot of grass and bushes to fill out the space. I think this area looks so cute, but now let me show you my shop. So this is the outside of my shop, and this is the inside. Over here, I have my workshop desk where I can make my custom creations. There's decor scattered throughout the space, and then over here is where I store the items I have to trade. Now that Dreamy Designs is officially open, I think it's time to make that hat for Shelby. This should do. I hope she likes it. Whoa, look 
look at all the mangroves. I hope Shelby doesn't mind that her hat's a little wet. It, uh, it just started raining as I got here. Whoa, this is nice. Hello? Hel hello? <gasps> hello? Special delivery. I have your hat for oh, you. My... And a oh, complimentary sunflower. Oh my god. Oh, thank <laughs> you. Uh, sorry if it's a little wet. It, it kind of rained on the way here. Oh yeah, it's, trust me, it's already always wet around here, and I'm sorry for the mud that you will be bringing back home with oh, you. It's okay. I tried to uh, make it a little bit more grassy around here, but this is beautiful. It's exactly what I wanted. And it matches your outfit. It's perfect. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I don't uh, have much right now, but I am That's getting okay. set up with potions and spells, Ooh. so I wanted to give you this IOU. Ooh. You can redeem at any point for anything magical that I have to offer. <gasps> Awesome, thank you so much. Yeah, well, I'm glad you like your hat. Have a safe trip home. Well, that was a fun trip. Hopefully we'll get some more customers soon. Anyways, I now have this. This will make delivery so much easier. I did not get it myself. Um, I let Joel fish my face and this was my prize for dying. <laughs> well, that's gonna be it for today. Make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you're new.